Welcome to America Trends. I'm Mary Burke Godwin talking to our resident cybersecurity expert, my friend, our friend here at the studio, Brad Rambert. Welcome back. Peace, Bob. For what the tech is going on? Yeah, well, you're you're wound about I'm this. I'm fired up today. Yeah, yeah. We got a, we got a big topic today. Well, I, it, first I want to ask you how you are. You doing good? I'm splendiferous. Splendiferous. Oh, okay. That's a good one. Busted out the that SAT words on this one. Yeah, you did. Yeah. That was uh, your song that we just heard. By it the was. Way. Car Chase. Yes. Made just mm -hmm. for our segment here on American or Or Mary's birthday song, we call it. <gasps> I want a special birthday song. It's still my birthday month, so I'm keeping my card here that the crew gave me. For just a couple more days, right? What are we, the 29th today? I know, I don't know how it's almost April already. What the heck? Yeah. Anyway, uh, today's topic is going to be pretty much all social media because so many of the links that I've been looking up in articles uh, are all related to places banning TikTok. And then I just heard today, which mm -hmm. you haven't even heard this one, but Utah is trying to ban all social media. Oh, I heard. Uh, yeah, for 18 and up. No, 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 18 and below. I'm sorry, 18 and below. Yes, thank you. Um, what would I do without you, Brad? I, uh, so <laughs> let's talk about this. So social. let's talk about first, well, France is banning TikTok, WhatsApp, and Netflix from state employee phones. They're starting with that. Mm -hmm. um, and I was like, okay, I get WhatsApp and TikTok. Mm -hmm. Well, I get TikTok for sure. Mm -hmm. WhatsApp has really been just a communication, mm -hmm. but I guess because it's on a state distributed yeah. phone, mm -hmm. they're thinking maybe not, right? Uh, well, yeah. So the thing is, is with WhatsApp, it's owned by Facebook, right? Meta. Meta. Mm -hmm. One of those. Yeah. Pick one. Pick a name. <laughs> and uh, that's not French. That, that data is being housed in the United States. Do the French want that? Got it. That is a communications platform on a government device. Uh -huh. Who knows if somebody prefers to communicate that way just because they're more facile with the software, they understand it better than are they conducting state business on a foreign owned platform? Who can see that data? How would that influence a political outcome uh -huh. or, you know, Department of State grade sort of conversation? And a deal. lot of people use it to message people that do not live in their same country. Sure. It's free. It's exactly so, what it is. Right. So that there could be some question marks there. What I was curious about with that one, though, is it's also net listed Netflix. And I thought, what? What's the problem with Netflix? Why can't we stream a few shows? But if it's on a state distributed phone, what's what's up with that? I, I, I could, What the tech with that, Brad? It, it could be about data consumption. And I don't know if you know this, but Netflix actually operates with different geographies. There's programming that is geographically specific that might be driven by language. It might be driven by what content any particular state wants to be viewable in their locale. Mm -hmm. um, so I, 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 I don't understand Which I don't why the Netflix thing I don't think I knew that either. until yeah. recently. Yeah. It's not Netflix around the world has the same shows. Their For You page is different. And it could be something as simple as you're on the clock stop watching Netflix. I'm paying you to do something. Uh-huh. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah. yeah. Stop watching Netflix, Jason. Jared's watching Netflix in there right now. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. see? They're watching it right now. I know. <laughs> yeah, it's there more it interesting. Is. <laughs> We're more interesting than anything on Netflix, let's just say. Yeah. Um, okay, and then <laughs> one okay, okay, one thing about TikTok. We've talked about TikTok for many, many reasons. Yes. Number one being what is the primary reason? That China owns it. Well, that the Chinese Communist Party, by law, can access any of the data in any Chinese-owned uh, or run company, mainland China. Yes. So any data that that company has, which is that on 150 million Americans, nearly half the population of the United States. They own and... They own it. They own that well, information, they, they, which is any information about... They collect and store it. Do they own it is another legal conversation, but yeah. It depends on whatever the user committed and admitted and agreed to. Yeah, which nobody knows because they just click the box. Who and reads say, the EULA? Yeah. Right, nobody. Right. The who? End user license agreement. The EULA. EULA. Oh, okay, I'm learning something. Did you know that? You got to get a EULA on your doula. <laughs> Or you're going to pay you a lot pulling, of moolah. He's going straight to the southern accent today. No, what man, is, well, just, you know, today? I just, my aunt Sadie's from it's Alexander, Louisiana. It's it's what, I, this is western. Yes, this is not southern. I do not look like Colonel Sanders. Yeah. This is when I, when I moved to Montana when I was a kid, I showed up in, you know, California clothes, in Vans and Levi's and a Hang 10 t-shirt. Uh -huh. And they're like, son, what's wrong with you? Well, they speak like us, right? Son. They don't, they don't, they're not doing the foghorn, leghorn. <laughs> 
thing. But that's deeper. Yeah, it's it's uh, further south, let's yeah. say. But yeah, so everybody had these, and I'm like, you know, I'm getting my Montana on. I like day. it. Yeah, thank you. I like it. Okay, so let's go though to this is really uh, disconcerting. So one of the mm -hmm. things about TikTok, the next level of yep. thing that we should be worried about, mm -hmm. is the algorithms and the content that is being pushed out to. Yeah these minors, mm -hmm. uh, well, anyone really, doesn't need to be minors, but particularly suicide and incel videos. Now, incel, I was just looking up the meaning of that. Yeah, you got that one? I got that one. That's so dastardly. It's... Involuntarily celibate. Involuntary celibate. So there is a group of boys, guys, men. Girls right? won't pay attention to me, therefore I'm going to hate them. Yes, which I believe the shooting in Santa Barbara there was a young man who shot up some sorority girls, mm. uh, my my former alma mater, or my alma mater. Um, he identified as incel, and that was his big thing. He shot these gals because he didn't have a chance with them, mm. and they weren't gonna look at him. So this content that's being pushed out is within the first, because there was a, well, maybe you know this, or you yeah. read this, right? You tell it. Uh, so the content about what again? The incel is oh, being yeah, so the, pushed the, out to them. Well. It, You know the phrase doom scrolling. Why do we keep looking? Because we want to see the negativity. We're more likely to remember negative things than positive things. It's a studied neurologic fact. Really? Oh yeah. So the, uh, the, the practical matter is, is all these platforms to get you to stick on them so they can show you some more ads, mm -hmm. put things on there that are gonna trigger you to con continue to look. Mm -hmm. And that varies from other people. I, and you know, we, uh, my family, we pulled the news out of the house for years to manage mood. It's crept back in because of devices, and I probably spend way too much time on it myself. Mm -hmm. And I notice what we it all do. I mean, and depending on what time of day you're looking at these things, that mm -hmm. stuff matters too. Like with the Utah thing, they want to, I think, block its use from 10:30 p.m. to 6:30 a.m. Mm -hmm. So people will actually sleep instead of doom scroll for all ages. Yeah. So the oh. so the content that gets put up, they're simply looking at what people go to get. And this was the problem with um, the AI with the chat GPT thing. Mm -hmm. I think it was BARD, B-A-R-D, the Microsoft tool. Oh yeah. They put right. it up and all of a sudden it went into some of the dark recesses of the internet and pulled really ugly things up and, and issued those back to the inquisitor mm -hmm. that was, you know, asking chat, the, the BARD, one of the AI tools, yeah. whatever it was, the questions. So if you write around about it a lot, does that mean that it is the dominant thing? No, it just means it's written about more. Why is it written about more? Because that's what people want to see. And the it, algorithm's serving it to you because they know that's what you want. Because, because they that. know it gets pulled up more mm -hmm. and they figure it's more likely to be seen. So they're trying to jump on that. It's like hit records. Why is this song a hit? Well, it sounds good. Or some people just decided they liked it even though it might not sound that hot. And then it becomes like a popular thing. Mm -hmm. It's the swallows to Capistrano. Everybody's turning a direction. So the Capistrano machine. is just an hour north of here for all of you non-Californians. Eh. Hour, you think? 45? Nah, yeah, 30 okay. minutes. Okay. And yeah, not far. So. So I have a question about the banning of tic or social media before uh -huh. kids are 18. Mm -hmm. How in the world, they're saying, oh, a parent needs to sign them up and have their permission. Mm -hmm. How in the world are they gonna know? Because right now it's currently 13. How do they know? You know, Is this where facial recognition and thumbprints or something is gonna come into play down the line? Because they're gonna be able to say, okay, I know that Mary Bird Godwin has these eyes and I know that she's of a certain age because she talks about her birthday all the time. Birthday! Um, so then they'll know, you know, is there gonna be a time when people are gonna know how old somebody is just by when they're looking, you know, their facial recognition. Um, it's entirely possible, but that would all be predictive analytics and would not be totally reliable because biologic ages and aesthetic outcomes don't, they're not one-to-one -one correlations. So like as a scientist, you're not gonna, that's gonna be a tough one. But no, what's gonna happen is parents are gonna have to take those tools off of the devices of their kids or they're gonna have to go re uh, up with the end user license agreement and I certify that this person is below 18 years of age and therefore by the operations of the state of Utah um, that will not function between these hours as settled a phone and then people are going to try to hack the timing on the phone and then the telco That's providers going to have to make sure the timestamp it's the whole thing. So what I'm curious is is like where can we get to a place where people are monitored of the content that's put out? Can, you know, it's like this wild, wild west of everything, can, anything can go out there. There's no way to police this or monitor it. This is what is so scary to You've me. You've gotten to the core of the human condition. Yes. 
Never let the facts stand in the way of a good story. Okay. That's what our species wants. Right. I don't care about facts. I like a good story. I want a good story. But, and so, but then with the web, anything can be a good story and anything can be put up there and there's no way we, we can say it's wrote monitored. It, yeah, just because you wrote it down doesn't mean it's fact. But also, it's not just fact, it's it's just the content, it's so dangerous. And we're, there's your song, that means we're out of time. Yeah. I think we should just get another one together and keep going because you're you're not ready to get out I'm of the I'm riled up. Next time, more riled up with Brad Ramper <laughs> on America Trend. Continue watching. We'll be right back right after this quick break. This is where we, this is our dance break. What if, blah, 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 blah.